Right, how are you guys doing? We're so excited that you are joining us right now on YTV4 Entertainment News. My name is Philin, at Philin Jin across all socials. The hashtag is YTV4 Updates. Now, we are all about trending topics, weekly trending topics right here in Kenya and internationally as well. Welcome to the show. We're going to have so much fun. But if you're a fan of the show, as always, you know we have the gang gang in studio joining us. I'm going to start with with our very own a superstar right here next to me, MCK. What is guys, happening? I missed you guys. <laughs> I'm so hyper Annie, for today. Mm -hmm. It's going to be crazy. yeah. So I missed last week. And I think the other week, Amma. Mm, yeah, two I've weeks. I missed two weeks. So yeah. guys, let's light it up. That's what's up. Yes. And we have our very own JC, as we call her, the sassy JC. What's up? Hi, 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 guys. <laughs> oh, so, <laughs> kama kawaida, guys, uh, tukai hapo na to see what's the change. MCK, no, I'm a kuja, to memkaribisha, we had missed him so no, much. No, people man. are sitting here, sana, with my wife. I had to make sure guys, we are doing, we are doing, we are doing matching clothes <laughs> so that when I'm here, I'm not here, you guys don't... Yeah, white and blue. Uh, they don't want to son. I don't get exactly white. My shirt is white. I can see that. Yes. yes. <laughs> It's, it's a memo. We have a, like, like, we were just like, yo, today, yes. this is what we're wearing, babe. Yes. Like, don't even, yes. so. anyway, <laughs> back to the show. Welcome to the show, guys. It's going to be fantastic. Let's start with our very first story right here. We had Joseph Irungu, commonly known as Joey, and also the key suspect in the murder case of businesswoman uh, who was found murdered in her house in Kilimani, Monica, uh, Monica. Uh, has has actually released a gospel song dubbed Nishikilie. Joey, who was accused alongside his then girlfriend, media personality Jackie Maribe, was released back in February on a two million Kenya shillings bail. Kenyans on social media, among them gospel singer Marcy Masika, have received his song positively. Marcy shared Joey's song on her Instagram with the caption, I'm glad to say I appreciate people who make decisions. God is about us turning to where we we are called and all things that work together for good for those who love him. We actually have a snippet of his song. Let's check it out. Deliver me from the hand of my enemies and from them that persecute me. Right, that is Joey Mose, Joey Irungo. Finally, like you know, when Joey Lamechaza Chini, since he oh, came out of prison, God, he's God. been God. keeping a low profile. We God. didn't even know where he's been. Now, say the first thing he did, Kutoa Gospel. What's happening, MCK? Why come a gospel artist? I am happy for him first mm -hmm. of all, mm -hmm. and then uh, I'm happy for him ten percent. But the other, the other person, unengeli mziki wakati kuna COVID. This is one of this is the one of the hardest time I need to join the gospel industry. Yeah? But I think for him it's gonna work because it's gonna bring some kind of plot. Mm -hmm. For him it's gonna work. So it's it's going to be so another thing is I think I think he might be in it for Claude or not. Mm -hmm. But I believe I believe when you no, go to jail, eh? but you know, before I think he's from Nakuru, and mm. way before he used to sing in a choir, I call him a choir church. Wow. Yeah, yeah, he used to sing in nice. a church choir. Yeah, and I guess him going to jail just told him like he should actually go back and do this because mm -hmm. every testimony I've heard of people who've gone to jail, eh? there's a way jail molds you, even if you're bad, you never let you go you you see, like, but they have a second chance, eh? right? What can I do? You mm -hmm. just feel like you want to preach or just. Uh, do motivational speaking or, or anything and just you know I'm a copy to God you know what you've given me a, another chance mm -hmm. thank you and if, he, if he's in it for a good cause mm -hmm. uh, we are going to support him mm -hmm. um, yes and we're calling out everybody to support him because he's doing it all. at least that we are going to yeah <laughs> Alright, let's sample some of the comments right here before we take uh, Jesse's comments. We have this on his Instagram, right? We have designer254 and I'm going to be a good stuff man. We have I am uh, Salua. Okay, 
Salwa Muhammad, I guess. And I'm be, wow, that song is powerful. You just read all of God's children's minds at this moment. They need God's grace and hands at Shikilia. Jessica Smith, and I'm be, nice vocals. It's lit. Yes. So, JC, Unona, it's lit. Are you agreeing with everybody else? Um, uh, what are your thoughts? Um, <laughs> and for Masi Masika, by the way, I mean, Mama, Mama, big up and everything. And I think uh, one thing we should do mm -hmm. uh, right now, sit him here, push away him. Say if and I make effort. Mm -hmm. uh, the fact that Kwanza is from jail. Yeah, I think it's not funny. I have never been there. We've never been there. Yeah. But from experiences, I say who who have been there, it's not mm -hmm. funny. It's either you come reformed, armor trashed than before. Yeah. So for him, I think society it's positive, and uh, the fact that he used to sing. Oh no, mpaka after you okay see little like people from his area were like, no, ni church boy. No, mm -hmm. he's been like this good boy in right. church. Mm -hmm. So I think it's not it's not a wonder. So it's not cloud. He's not. Trying, I don't it's think. Not a PR okay, if stand. ata kama ni kiki pia mm -hmm. ni kiki ambayo ni kitu ambacho amekuwa kifanya. Mbelini. So, yeah. Uh, Nikikia yeah. kitu ambayo anaweza. Yeah. If you you see you've listened to you've you've listened to the song. It's a good song. Yeah, I think go for it, Joy. Yay! Let's just out. Now we have a post on Facebook. That is at White If I Falls Facebook. Go check it out and comment below. What is your take on this story? Well, no, no, no. Joy ya mwako kaya ukweli ya mereform ama anatuchocha tu na anataka kutengeneza jina Sindio, do let us know and if time allows it we're going to be sampling some of your comments and uh, yeah your comments at the end of the show right about now let's move on to the next story now Kenyan radio presenter come singer Tanasha Donna and Tanzania's socialite Hamisa Mobeto have found uh, have formed rather a new friendship that has got netizens talking on social media now the two are both bongo star diamond platinums baby mamas and the most uh, and most people expected a rivalry a rivalry rather or hate between them but they seem to have buried the hatchet and decided to support each other's dreams Mabeto styled and dressed sanasha during the video shoot of her latest release liar featuring kenyan singer masauti and since then the two haven't stopped posting and complimenting each other on social media all right so hey baby mama drama it's not actually Aww. happening they're just like Aww. apart from zari the two of them were memo you know what why do you even hate each other you know what to funny kitu maze you have business you you have talent you're singing Bona, why don't you build each other up do you think that's genuine <laughs> One thing I've learned with um, Tanzanian entertainment, mm -hmm. uh, Nafki. <laughs> you remember when 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 um, Tanasha was married to Diamond? Yeah. Kina Rani, Kina Mujago, Kina Nani, Kina Jumalo Kole, they were friends, mm -hmm. Kina Aristote, mm -hmm. you know, saying how she's all beautiful and everything. After I'm going to say that, I'm going to say Yes, I, I don't, I don't, I, I think it's the first scenario when I'm a big mama on Yeah. I think this is the first. They're posting each other. I'm, I'm, I'm mm. telling you. Yeah, if, Something is uh, cooking. If I'm going to if I'm going to go to the I'll be like a mistake. Yeah. And behind those, I'm sure there's one of them. A coach in your chin and a summer. A real son yaki, to live in Valley, I told you, you're not a market yaki. We're in Nakisa, from what I've seen. Hamisa. Like, 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 you know what? It's 2020. Women are building each other up. Mm -hmm. It's not yes, helping. Mm -hmm. Yes, yeah. yeah. it's not helping. Yes, 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 it's not Maybe. I don't know. You know, um, okay. Maybe. We, maybe. Maybe she should maybe, have. Maybe. <laughs> it's not a hundred. Maybe. And, and maybe always is always a no. Mm -hmm. maybe you just know it's a no but Hamisa is out here you see like the video playing on TV she was jamming to Tanasha's latest song <laughs> Akimba <laughs> Kasema <laughs> Mama Nasib <laughs> like it's all business I need to go nini need go cross um, cross advertising mm -hmm. nini we get, get your point we get your point so it was booming here and 
Tanzania. Exactly. You're killing two birds with one stone. Yes. I got it. JC, hmm? do you think Kensuke is right? Am I, are you all about women empowerment? Let's go, let's go. Actually, well, do you know, uh, it's actually still on YT54 page. Just yesterday, there's a research that was conducted and it found out that more women, women actually have more money than men. Especially, you're in Kenya, but people are saying even in East Africa. So, do you think that is what happening? What is happening? Like, women are building each other up. That's why women have more money. Am I, you're too nikiki, hamisa, natafuta. Okay. Yeah. Uh, women can never be cooked in one pot. Hatuwezi. Like, hatuwezani kuwa kwa nyungu moja. Hatuwezi. Lazima, at the end of the day, we must, we must have wale watu ambao watagongana vichwa. Hawa watu wawili vile tunawajua, they've been in dramas before. Hapa mm -hmm. kuna kitu inaiva. Na itakamu, inatoka. Ama, ama damo na nulule u kitu moja, sinule moja. Ama sasa waliona vile kuyenda ile, ile, ile story ya gift. Tunakumbuka kulikuwa na gift ilipeanwa. E, kwa ule, e, sasa wakaona, wachatu onyeshe. E, sasa wanatafta attention. And if, if they are looking for attention, MCK, you know, like they've got it. Ndiyo sisi ya watu naongea hapa. So, kama ni kiki, imeiva. He may have a bus in like on point. Mm -hmm. So, like in his I don't, I don't really think it's necessary. It is. It is. It is. For their business, maybe. Yeah. Business. Yeah, business. Na ni kama ni business ya Hamisa. Mwajapia Hamisa kona, kona uzito kwa Tanzania. Tanzania. Mm. Yeah. But she has way more followers than even uh, Tanasha. Na, 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 she has. Na, 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 <laughs> ma die yeah. Mm. Na, mm. But let me tell you something. Tanzania's fans. Always want be a key to. If they decide it's you, it's yeah. you. Always like you try touch Ali Kiba mm. or try touch Wema. You know those are Tanzania's sweethearts. So say, uh, well, our family. Get another say who want to be the ma fans one. Want to our Hamisa want to our Mukia. Want to our Mbio. Maki go warriors. Eh, you should make it to your channel, Rafkiet. Only do only to tell to our Shakzalia Simba. Yeah, I said that. Now, okay, I said that. I don't want to let you go. What channel we on? My one comment. Well, I was talking about this one comment that always stuck in my mind. And this is a Jay talker. Sister Diamond. Someone was like, Mbona mlifanya tanasha hivyo. Siju ni nini ni kwende ni huko. Nakambia, eh, wena tanasha mshaka usa. Mshaka kwa meza moja mkakula. Unamunyua. Wana wana kwa mbeda mbeda mbeda. Wana wana kwa mbeda mbeda mbeda. But what I like about Tanzania is that actually most of their singers really know how to sing. I don't think I'm coming to Tanzania. They really, really know how to sing. He has such a nice voice. He's the next person to look out to. We're going to take him out. 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 All right, now, a casual labor, labor rather, by the name uh, Jamstar Music has become a topic of discussion on social media. After his post went viral, Jamstar posted on his socials, both Twitter and Instagram, a video of him singing Girl of My Dreams by D Major while working at a construction site with a caption, and I quote, got a hustle and still want to search for the girl of my dreams, end of quote. Now, he quickly got responses from users who thought he was very talented on Twitter, producing that Tim Rimbui asked him to reach out so that he could work on something. While on Instagram, comedian YY offered to pay for a studio session for him. Well, video. Now I gotta find her in reality, yeah. She's the one with whom I share everything. Those kind of messed up. Cause now I gotta find her in reality, yeah Where to search, where to go, where to turn, I don't know Girl, I'm gonna find ya, oh yeah Sure, I'm gonna find ya, like a kiss from a road Right, actually, what? This guy is super, super, super talented. Yani, akuna keyboard, akuna guitar, akuna nini, just vocals, and he murdered it. Alright, now, why, why, right here, this is actually Instagram, alikuwa mesema, can I take you to the studio? And I actually agree, so you come out here, he's go actually gonna take that, and uh, there's actually DJ Shiti, akusema, bro, you are going places. And I agree with Shiti, with good management, 
Jones na ashikilo tu mkaona vizuri don't we agree mck wewe kama msanii yeah. unaonaje yeah. someone is giving you a run for your money ama uko sawa eh that's in the kija eh but it's actually listen uh, i think you all know in your show video yeah. i loved it mm -hmm. no or did you know anything pure talent eh? so on a lighter note i think wale wa mono za kama ona za ka vikombe chai chai nini uji Mm -hmm. Be very cautious. Yeah. Gada na zaga pole kwa. Okay, you're joking, you're Peter. Anyway, you may understand. You may understand. He's really good. He's really good. Uh -huh. And uh, the way I say, what, what was going on? It sounds too weird. You are cloud already. Yeah. Okay. Help the guy, by the way. Yeah. Uh, and do you he's think really he's? Dope. Do you think he's really, pers like a. Uh, ako like we ni msewa mjei awa amenda kama amenda tu hapo kuimba ndo watu wa mfeve cuz though in his captions al sema he's not a, he's not like a, how do you say this he's not ashamed of his hustle that like that's what he does he's not ashamed of his yeah. and he's actually learned sisi ni msewa ala nini ni msamenda shule ama soma si una kama sahi ama kama sahi like uh, for example dapata kuna sisi kama si ala ni kwa for example siko na promote kitu kwa wali yangu mm -hmm. i start promoting because of the times yeah. heavy sai aqua aqua play sports sai ana do atakamsele kibaru alikuwa nayo so ina have amedu like to amedu asa ni ana pretty a lot of stress outside yeah once if you, you don't have any channel to make money so maybe ako tu hapo hivyo atafute unga ya kila siku you get yeah. so yeah, exactly because he looks very learned mm -hmm. he looks very clean uki angalia long ya mevaa si he long he fit in again so yeah. he's somebody who's actually learned and then he was like you know what let me just do this thing and uh, having this and everything as props he may never go somewhere people actually liked it yeah and he actually uh, keep post twitter he was like it won't cost it will cost you zero euros to retweet exactly now to come to retweet they like yeah because it doesn't cost you anything just to retweet or to like something unaweza kuta mtu atasaidia msanii ndio under studio but we don't really push them far and do we even buy music That's we uh, watch out was I need support Yana or something or even producers like shout out to Tim Rimboy by the way he reached out to him on Twitter kama akamwambia uh, they should link up work on something together and he's a dope 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 producer right i was meet team was in the studio was tengeneza ngoma then what are you going to buy his music mm. at the end of shows at the show yeah because the consumers since it's going to go make on youtube to net download for free you know sometimes i think sometimes i think sometimes yeah uh huh i think sometimes what we get they understand do you know actually in kenya if you have very good sales people you can actually do street selling and make a lot of money yeah if you have the good management that's on your strategic uh strategic selling uh selling points of uh, like an album or an EP you can actually sell a lot like for, let's just just give me one minute eh? for example you're an artist you're an upcoming you have very good management exactly yeah what you do is look for people who are known you got to have like four people put this guy on yeah go to the streets mtu anaangalia karibu na unaoza maybe album na maybe like 200 shillings or anything yeah with with, with good sales say, uh, with, a, with a good sales person trust me with 200 mko mko ata feel like kununua kununua album ya ama EP ya ngoma ka sita is worth it because hapa nanunua ngoma moja na kitu kama 15 bob yeah ni kama kununua tu bundle za kawaida he will buy the problem is wasanii wengi Kenya na waga zembe but if you listen to Rington very well and how he used to sell his music that's how that guy made most of his money yeah Yeah. So exactly so uh, market ya Kenya inataka uze street wise you become right. street You have to be mind. street smart. Kwa sababu tuna geza ma Spotify manini ya ada watu kona iPhone. Apo in music they don't buy. They don't buy true, 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 true. Yeah. So ours is street. Oh. Yes. Okay. Yes. JC. Yeah. What's your take? Uh, I I one one thing nearly here yeah, like uh like you Are you okay? Yeah, ni ni watu wenye ambao wamenipigia simu. Kuna watu wananipigia simu by the way. We don't answer phone. All right. Yeah. Yeah. Sawa. So, stop calling her until yeah, I take kwa TV. All right. So, what, what do you think? What do you think yeah, about so this? Yeah, so this is it. <laughs> I I got so happy that yeah. once unajua like Kenya hakuna mm. jobs. Yeah. Once amesoma, he's talented. Hakuwa na channel ya ku come out mm. and he went he hustled Hajiba Mse and then go at at his own appointed time tukajua kumhusu now the worst part is when it comes to kenyans tutakuwa tu sisi ni kibodwares tutafanya all we can we will make for, for promises you know like people who are in that position ya kusaidia they won't do anything they, they, they just don't even care about it like msee hata atafanya go for cloud aseme nitamfanyia nitamfanyia ndio mseme eh hey, na nani alisema 
atafanya but you know we don't even follow up to know kulienda aje huu mm. msi akona talent raw talent huu mtu atajaenda kwa kwa studio hiyo mm. ni music ambayo it's just fresh ameimba vile tunaweza ambiwa busing and it's so good and it's unfortunate the kind of job he's doing anafaa kwa hiyo talent yake imenulipa mo aje kuna ni huma tu bado and i have to see it is a these producers who say they are going to help artists in Kenya you will never help an artist by doing him one song. If yeah. you want to help an artist, do him an old album. album. Or even sign him, Maze. Yes. Just Ama sign album him. No. Album kuta kwa msaidia msaidia. Mm. Kuta kwa msaidia sana sana sana. Yeah. Now, Now we, have, we have some of the comments from the guys on Twitter right here. What people had to say. Let's just check them out. This Gloria Karanja. Lisema alieka fire emoji. We have Anita Pressures. Lisema you have a great voice. A great a breakthrough is coming. And you're going to be a star from Kenya to the world my yes, dear amen. that is true and then there's someone else uh, uh, oh Jimo Jimo akakapia fire emoji that means he and accept my dear and I'm kubali we have Aima and I say my way umomoka sasa wazee talent inga manisha ni kuomoka tunge kuwa mbali just go in Kenya not even in Kenya I'm telling you not just Kenya everywhere across the world talent pays talent pays but you gotta work hard i know kuna watu wengine they are very kuna watu wengine they don't know how to sing shida yangu ya talent ni moja ni waulize eh tunaweza kuwa tuko na the same talent mnajua tuko kwa hii panel juu tuko na something in common yeah but there is always someone who is always doing better than the other one right so you have i think you have to keep up you try to fill in the on alimba na alikuwa like we really need to get such voices too lakini to support yani we have to support each other and another thing kuna watu they don't know how to sing but they're doing so well because they know how to push oh, wait yeah. so, go for those auditions go for those auditions go for those auditions go for those voice practices do whatever you've got to do to get ahead because you can go get me and tell me kuna mesema na watu wajui kuimba like i feel like so well kabi kabi da video sio na ya kuimba na go ahead go show boka wewe alright so the hashtag the hashtag is why to fight for updates now let's go to another story now where well, a controversial self proclaimed president of single mothers and a singer Esther Akothe has called out radio presenter Masawe Japani in a very bitter social media rant Akothe accused Masawe of having ill intentions while interviewing her daughter Vesha Okello in the interview Masawe inquired about her upbringing since her parents had separated and that did not sit well with Akothe Akothe cautioned all present and bloggers against asking her children personal questions during interviews where <laughs> you know that is too long i can't even read <laughs> yeah, he, he, he pages <laughs> pages and pages this <laughs> i cannot even read it but she was very 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 mad i don't know i can read maybe the first just the first sentence and some all presenters gossipers and the rest keep off my children's past out of your interviews and mouths anytime you call any of my children for an interview stick to the questions you said you will ask don't try to gain impact with my children's painful past they don't know and will never understand why they are raised in a single family she is very upset and then she posted a photo of her and her children back then the one on your screen eh mazel kwa mekach where 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 i cannot even imagine what is happening was she yeah i'm talking fast and so is a cause being petty or is she being a protective mother of late of late i think a cause is being petty tangulia time alikuwa kwa blog friend wakisema mesota na struggle amekuwa akifanya vitu zingine tu fani fani of course anafanya ga vitu but of late amekuwa akizifanya a different way and another thing i think i understand as much as i'm again your gina when you introduce your kids to the limelight yeah Yani expert fees of vitu mm-hmm. they will come up mm-hmm. once you're a child you're a kid of the limelight yeah all those questions will always come ara kama sio uko chini ya maji ara wanaulizwa una get so it's something that will always come up it's high time as i could realize by the ah they not wakubwa una get they can talk about it if they don't want to talk about it but lazima zitaulizwa you get mm-hmm. people want to get ratings and everything yeah and so kianza kuambia bia kila mtu hivyo utakuwa unafungia watoto wako manjia because akona mwana basi na mtaenda vyema kama kuna interesting 
Because she has, I, I think what she meant was that she needs to know the questions you're going to ask beforehand. Mm -hmm. And for me, I don't think that is right. That As is a presenter, Mimi right. could be a guest maswali before I could hear it. And it's also natural. Yeah. 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 It, it doesn't, it makes sure it's not quite staged. But, 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 but well, again, I think I kind of understand her. You understand if where you she's coming from? If you read the whole from. post, yeah. like she's saying, uh, if you if you listened to the interview, the daughter was being, it's like the presenter was trying and attacking the girl about being raised by a single mom. You know, it's not funny. I don't know what I'm going to say. No, she asked many questions. She asked many questions. She asked many questions. She asked many questions. I didn't hear you. Uh, uh, okay, I, I saw it was posted by mm. someone. And uh, I said, what do you hate about your mom? Exactly. So, like, 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 you know, like something like, in MCK. Yo, why are you asking that? There's always something. But, nah, uh, nah, uh, uh, no, 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 MCK. This is it. I, 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 I feel Pia mekua na kiki mom sana. That, that I agree. Mm. But again... Her being a mom and and knowing she's solo in this, like she's the mom and she's the dad to these kids. Hana mtu mungine ambaye mwenyaneza kibiria. I love our watoto MCK. Let me just finish. Our watoto wana kuangana something. There's always that, okay, there's, there's something called kanyama in my, 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 my native language. Uh. Yo kanyama, inakuanga ni that kukosa, kukosa the, the, the dad figure mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. in your family mm -hmm. in a kwanga ile mindset for, for girls in mambayo ni ingi mm -hmm. so oh mama anajua mtoto wake you know like hakuna mtu anajua mtoto wake kama mama mm -hmm. na anajua huu mtoto wakienda hapo sika tai mtoto wakisha kuwa wa celebu sha waleta kwa nini kwa nini kwa showbiz lazima wata, that hakuna privacy mm -hmm. but pia wewe as an interviewer when you're interviewing this is a baby see okay see mtoto ni grown up yes but si fikiri mindset yake is strong enough mm -hmm. To have the right like courage yeah, to answer some questions. There are some things that Philip you can answer, mm -hmm. and there are some things that your mom needs to be there to, to defend answer. you. Yeah, true. Okay. And definitely, right. a mom will always come in to defend you. Mm -hmm. As interviewers, if you're interviewing somebody, yeah. Maybe you can do it in your own way. Maybe you can do it in your own way. Like you can do it in your own way. Like you can do it in your own family. Yeah, like it was too much. But you can do it in your own way. Like how does it feel like growing without a father? Maybe that's her way of asking questions. Yeah, but she doesn't have to be honest. Maybe that's her way of asking questions. Different people have different ways of asking questions. Yeah, they have different approach. So maybe that's how she handles all her interviews. And maybe she meant well. Maybe she has an issue. Alright, and on that note, would love to hear from you. What do you think about this story? Akwathe, Achizu Chini, Ama Masawe was too much. The hashtag is Y254 Updates. Talk to us on our social media. We have a post on Y254's pegs. Comment below and we're going to sample some of the comments. Now on to the next story where Karoshe Brewery's hair race and her husband Ben Ben Paul, okay, Karisha, I'm going to take that again. Karisha Breweries, Annalisa Moigai, and her husband, Ben Paul, were rumored to have broken up just last week after they two unfollowed each other on their Instagram pages. Netizens were quick to give their opinions, with some saying they knew their union won't last. But just a week <laughs> after, the two are back on social media together. Ben Paul posted a video on his on his Instagram vibing to Kanda Bongo Man's song while Annalisa sat pretty next to him my question is wale watu wa mtaachana tu mtaambia nini watu mtaambia nini watu eh tulisema maneno ya watu wawili mtu akiingilia shout out to deno denis den mwangiz mwangiz na mwangiz alikuwa hapa akasema nilijua tu nilijua wataachana hao endi mali watu wanakupurupuka watu wanapendana mtafika wapi mso mambo ya watu wawili waachana nayo waachana nayo sasa watu hapo i think i don't know Okay, let's have a look at some of the comments. Kuna mgini anachua, wafula Melvin anasema, Uda kuna Nairobi gossip mills leo, wataweka wapi surazi hao. Wawo walikuwa meleta yosipi. That's the, Ani, guys are just like, okay, vocalist, there's someone else who, Ben Ipupa. Ani, do you want to go on a wine west? Okay. People are thinking that, okay, they are late, 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 late. I like that. So, Someone else has said, I'm going to meet my hips too. 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 I'm going to meet my hips too.
<laughs> All right, I'm going to start you, with you. Huh? I think I know what you're going to do. Mm -hmm. We've not been talking about this yeah. for a long time. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think you all have to say, my heart was because I could get a layer. You get. I'm like, let's just do something. I'm people to talk about us and then, Kidoko, Kidoko, Kidani, Kunana, Kunandadi. No, you say you guys. Keep <laughs> oh. Yeah, you push to them. Oh. We're still together. Love lives here. Yeah. Break up for who? More you you remember last week to Luliza Mbona to Jafanya's story the river to kuifanya jutena to ngei have kuifanya tena to clarify to the citizens kwamba wako pamoja bado Mimi nilikuwa najua waja chana like ini kiki ilikuwa kiki like Ben Paul ajatoa ngoma like if you look na hiyo hakuna kitu anelisa amekuwa nayo ya kuleta kwa social media so we expected this like kiki MCK plus guys mtu anaweza toa unajua kifaring sana pia na choshanga mtu anaweza lijua anaweza amepiga picha ametoa ring ni nini hivyo hata labda anatoa anga akilala akilala like hatuwezi jua kila kitu like yo you need to chill out on people's business you know but see what Kenya is too acha wachanganya tizen kama na yenda hapa so now another story that is making headlines on social media but this one mkumbuka it's 7 p.m now can you talk about a saudi soul now they posted for Photos um, on social media, the whole band with their significant others. Kila mtu na wa, na wake. Kila mtu na demu wake. And then it caused a lot of uh, controversy mm -hmm. since Chimano was post, uh, was posted standing next to a guy, a white guy. So that brought a, a lot. Tall, of a handsome <laughs> white <laughs> guy. Kwa nini una kosa kutumia adjective? Maze, so I'm a saying tall, you. handsome mm -hmm. white Guy, Imereta Shida, Imereta Shida is a problem. Paletira, Paletira, Akukaliki. So, I'm gonna start with you, JC. Mm -hmm. What you take? Like, are, are Kenyans being too much? First of all, thank you for, for doing this. Thank you, Timo. Thank you, Philin. And I liquid my request for group. Thank you. It is a surprise. So, uh, what's it? Swachani na Maisha Watu. This is an African context. And uh, we only have one life and by aina repair. Whether ni beshe yake, whether ni the significant other, whether ni nini, like, guys, stay out of other people's business. Hydrate, look for money, live your life. Mm. Hydrate, look for money, <laughs> live your life. Okay, yeah. so, uh, MCK, what you take? What do you say about what's happening? How did that do you say? That is the photo in a letter issue. You see that photo that is on screen right now? You know, to a Kenya one get it, they're like, okay, so kill them to go now. Okay, so what you know, you know, you know, anyway when you're okay but you don't have you have a problem with the way they are dressing yes all right zinafala kama alimachisha vitenge ali my boots kfck guys guys Guys, <laughs> guys, <laughs> we must investigate. Alita put them to Murefu Kumuliko. Mm. Hmm. 
Mm. Okay, and then I was like, All right, so yeah, let's like do this. It. Let's sample some of the comments on uh, Facebook. In Luambia, you guys at home, you should send in the comments and we're going to sample some of them. Okay, let's Amma. start. Now, Eman Johnson has said, What story is Chimano? What was Shugulika and my shoes? Yeah, don't judge someone simply because an Afanya Ville Ulikwa won't expect. But, okay, but they will use MCK, come the same WhatsApp group. <laughs> Usichome, usichome. My, my kids, sisters and my fans, they are watching. Usichome. Usichome. You understand what you look so well. <laughs> <laughs> All right, let's go to the next comment. <laughs> shout out to you, man, Jim. See, we're going to talk about that. All right, G Rapper, I'm um, G Rapper KE from Kenya, TZ Border, side is a Ilan Sit. Now, Kuna song to release in a Javi Boko. Okay, we're going to check out the song, right? Ashazi Sizo and it's my lock from Mombasa. Please, we tell you, I'm Jengo Neza get number yake. I'm an I have someone who can work with him and he will achieve the dream. I'm gonna send you. I'm gonna send you his handle uh, after the show. Sindio. Eriko Tush comes in. and say, mark me present. Aras and Daniel Massive Tarakaniti. Thank you so much. Where Paul? I see you. Thank you. Rasta Culture. Vincent uh, Sigor. Uh, Alex Njagi. Felis. Mark Solomon. Dennis Miner. And then we have Mama Ken. Nancy, okay, we have so 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 many of you guys. So I'm gonna tell Mama K Nancy, thank you so much. Your last remarks in social media. Uh, my last remarks is uh, <laughs> let's continue sanitizing, keeping safe, praying for each other, and you know, <laughs> living our best lives. I love expected you guys. something different. Uh, I know that's why my enemies. I love you guys. Now come on, come on. Who from India is I'm, I'm going to look for you. By a soda. Thank you guys. Right, Jesse, Jesse. Right. Oh, happy Jesse. birthday, happy birthday, Angel, my smallest sister, Kitinda Mimba. I love you. Tomorrow we're going to let it up. Happy birthday, Angel. Happy birthday, Angel. Yay. Yay. All right, Jesse, your yeah, last remarks. Oh, remark. yeah, Watere, and I watch. Come mm -hmm. Kawaida. And uh, everyone else who tuned in, Cindy, yes. now shukuru sana. But guys, mind your business, Cindy. Mm -hmm. Yeah, mind your own business. Not to yeah. hydrate, and we pray. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah, so I'm Jesse Mogore Facebook, Jacinta Mogore Instagram, and Mogore Moresha Twitter. I have. Uh, <laughs> Time. All right, all right. So, uh, thank you so much. I want to shout out Dennis Bob Miner. I make work you watch. He's going to be here next week. Shout out to Janet, Junil, Ron, and then oh, my cousin Willie. He's watching as well. Mose, Agi, Roda, Robert, Stella. Okay, so many. Dev, there's so Mike. Thank you so much, guys. It's always a great time. We're going to see you again next week with an even better show. But keep sanitizing, stay safe, and we'll see you uh, next week. Oh, shout out to Maurice. And Timo and Frank and Rose, thank you so much, guys. We're gonna see you uh, next week. Wambi, 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 Wambi,